colouring pencils are made here in a pencil factory. This factory makes a hundred million pencils every year. That's enough to fill five double-decker buses. Most coloured pencils are made with wood on the outside and on the inside, running all the way through the middle, is the colour for colouring. And here they call that the core, a little bit like an apple core. The core of all coloured pencils starts out with a material called clay. And here, the clay looks like a white powder. But to turn this into a brightly coloured core, we need something else. We need something called pigment. And pigment is a brightly coloured powder that gives colouring pencils their colour. Looks something like this. Wow, we have a bright pink. In here, there's a blue. We've got, whoa, look at that yellow. We will see lots of different colours being made today. First, the pigment and clay powder is poured into a mixing machine, along with some water. In it goes. The machine mixes the water and powders together and then dries it all out until it becomes a crumbly mixture. This one is going to be a brown coloured core. Finally, to make the core, the mixture is poured into a machine called a billeting machine. Inside, this part of the machine is a huge plunger that rises up from out of the ground and squashes together all of that dried mixture at the top into a cylinder shape. Look, here it comes. Wow. <laughs> all of the mixture has been squashed together to make a giant core. But we don't need a pencil that big, do we? So the cores are put into a machine called an extruder. Now it's making white cores. The large block of white is going to get pushed through this small hole to make much thinner sticks. You ready? Wow! Look how fast it goes! The thin white sticks are pushed out and caught by chains which roll them out of the machine. How many thin sticks that one large block of white is making? The sticks are rolled in a machine to make sure they're straight. Then baked in an oven. And finally, dipped in melted wax. These ones will make blue cores. The coloured cores soak in the wax for three hours and this will make the pencils much stronger and smoother to colour with. Ah, uh, there we go. The wax has made it lovely and smooth to draw a big smiley face with. <laughs> so now it's time to make the outside of the pencils. These are the pieces of wood that are going to make our pencils. And can you see they have grooves in them? And those grooves are just the right size for one colour core. That means that this piece of wood will make one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight coloured pencils. And then the other piece of wood just sits on top like that. So we kind of make a coloured pencil sandwich. The pieces of wood go into a colour filling machine where these yellow coloured cores are slotted into place and fixed with glue. And lastly, the second piece of wood is stuck on top, making our coloured core sandwich. It's brilliant! Next, those pencil sandwiches are broken down into single colouring pencils that we can use. And for that, the wooden block is pushed through a set of these. And these will give the pencils their shape. But they are falling out of the machine so quickly. I think we should take a look with my special camera. This is my special slow motion camera. And it lets me see things slow right down. So let's take a look at these pencils coming out of the machine. Wow, they look a bit like
like little worms popping out. Finally, the pencils are sharpened to give them their pointed ends. And here we have some brand new finished colouring pencils. Oh, and these ones are a brilliant bright green colour. Oh, I can't wait to get colouring in.